Today, we're going to go back to the race house to see what secrets we missed and also things that you probably missed yourselves. So let's go and head there right now. And guys, right now, down below in the comments, what's your favorite type of car? If you do not like cars, what's your favorite type of vehicle in general? I want to know. Tell me down below in the comments right now. But okay, so we're going to select a random spot for this house to make it as easy, simple, because you never know what we're going to find inside today. Because honestly, out of all the houses that are here, this is the only one that doesn't have a major secret. I'm not even joking with you. This one here has a bunch of agency related things and storyline related stuff. This one has more stuff that I can name right now, which I already did a few videos on this. So you go check those out. And also, this one has like kind of a cool secret. It's kind of cool, but not super major, but it's still better than the race house's secret. Then we have this house that has an agency secret inside of it. This one right here has a uh, like a couple secrets and actually causes stuff to happen around the map which is pretty cool we have this one that has a ton of them and then the race car one which is the new one doesn't really have any at all so we're gonna do some big exploring today and honestly i should probably take a helicopter and go to the bottom of this baby to see if we can find anything but some of the stuff that i want to show you before you even take that helicopter is a couple of things that you can do around the house you can go hide and seek you can go and find some things never know one of these might be here right now a secret oh secret like look at this you see this tv right here this is a very big tv if we go outside you're gonna see that this wall we don't want to sit down i don't know why i just did that but i did you're gonna see that this wall isn't too huge like literally it looks actually it does look a lot bigger than it probably should there might be a secret behind that tv maybe the ages is hiding something behind there then we have these big rocks which, oddly enough, feel like they would work over there, but they probably wouldn't. Honestly, I should probably have loaded over there at this point. So, I know I just said I was going to show us a few other things. Now, I'm curious about this TV. I don't think I looked behind here last time. And, guys, while you're at it right now, leave a like because likes do very much matter. And sharing this video around would very much help me out. And I know you guys like my content. You want to see me succeed. So, that will be awesome. You could do that for me right now. Okay. So the wall isn't as big as I thought it was. It does have a little space behind it, but it doesn't have too much. Right here, though, you can hide right here in the little corner if you're small enough. But if you guys did not know, if you squeeze yourself in here just enough, you can actually go inside the fireplace. Yep, that's right. Actually, we could just go this way. I didn't even realize we could do that. And over here, you can't hide. But right in the corner, you can definitely hide if you're small enough and skinny enough. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. But one of the cool things is you can actually sit down in the vehicle. Yeah, you don't have to own this car to build a ride in it. I think this is one of the VIP ones, if I remember correctly. Uh, does this look like it? No, that's not the vehicle. Is it? Is that the one? I, oh, there we go. There it is. Yeah. So if you don't have one, you can definitely just chill inside of it and just feel like you're really cool. Maybe you can trick your friends into thinking you have a really cool car. But yeah. So now what we're going to do is we're going to shrink down. So as you see, now that we're shrunken down, we can actually go in the back of the car and hide back here. No one's going to find you, especially if you lay down on the ground. If you go, uh, lay down just like that, you'll be able to hide and no one will be able to find you. It's pretty awesome, I know. And you can even hide in the front of it as well. See, look at this. You can't see me. I can't see you. No one can see us. We're hiding really well. So as you realize, this is a really good thing to do. Being small and tiny on this map, or well, this house, is a good thing to do if you want to hide in different spots. You can sit in the side of the car like this, chilling in there. Yep, you've seen that right now. And like I said, right here, well, I slide around when I'm tiny. I don't get it. So you can hide right here, so no one can see you now. But that's not all, guys. There's so much more about this house that is really crazy. So we're going to go ahead downstairs right now, which I feel like down here... There are still some secrets like over here. You can definitely hide in all these all the back walls you have over here These are all hideable. You can actually go inside give every single one of them. Yep, that's right And you can't hide in none of these like I really really wish you could but you can't we can hide in this right here You can hide in okay. Okay, maybe you can't hide in these. Okay. That's really weird I like how one side you can hide but the other one you cannot this one No, it's kind of weird that these are solidified and the other ones aren't hmm that's a little bit sus. Maybe we'll survive something when we actually go and take this, uh, the helicopter over here. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But we also have this car right here, which may not appear so. But you can also hide in it in a different way. Like, you can get tiny whiny, like I am right now. You can hide in the front. If you're really good and change your color just right, you can probably hide right here. See, you can't see me now because I'm holding the, 
the button to make it so I can go forward a lot more. But as you realize, you can hide in there. That's a really good spot to hide. You can go in here, and as I already did before, you can lay down, and no one will find you. It's pretty awesome. I know, I know. You guys are jelly. You're jelly. Super jelly. But yeah, that's another little cool thing you can do right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. And this room here has a bunch of secrets. First of all, uh, you could probably do the same thing here if you do it the right way. You can't hide right there, but you can hide probably uh, right here. Yes. See? Look, no one's going to suspect you being over here. Like, honestly, this is a really good hiding spot. So, over here is also a hiding spot, but you can't click on this one right here. But, for those that did not know, you can open it up, and there you go. You have yourself a secret safe, and it closes on you, too, so you can hide in there as well. Pretty awesome. I know. I know. So, in here, there is not really much you can do to hide, but... This is not really supposed to meant to be a hide-and-seek episode, by the way. Just showing you guys in general what is actually in here. And then, shower you can't hide. You already know you can hide in all of those. But also, I want to mention now, the ceiling has been checked by multiple, multiple people. But that doesn't mean I can, can't check again for you guys. Just to show you that there's nothing up there. Because I know some of you might go, Dar said something's in the ceiling. But I'm going to show you right now that there is nothing up here. Then we're going to grab ourselves a helicopter because, you know... This might be super duper helpful to us. Okay, up, up, and there you go. See, look at this. See over here, there looks like there could be something, but probably is not. These are just the end walls, and I'm pretty sure those don't mean anything. Like, if we go outside, we can take the helicopter up on top, too, if we really wanted to. But I'm not sure if that's going to be helpful at all. But yeah, those right there are just little end things. And this one right here definitely looks like it may have something hidden inside. So what we can do is we can do this and we can go outside and there we go now all we need to do is drop this down like this go up here like this and bam oh, oh that didn't work uh bam okay there we go okay and ah there we go and inside this yeah it looks like there's nothing inside this either that would have been awesome finding like a super big secret but as you guys realize there's no huge secret here. It doesn't have anything to do with any of the stuff going around the server. You just have a secret safe room. And that is really weird. Because usually those houses at least have something that's more largely based around the secrets. Except for that other military base one. But that military base itself is just a secret on its own. What's happening over here? Look at them. They're just chilling, relaxing. Oh, they don't look at... What? Blah, 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 blah. You okay? You fine? Oh, they're just running off. Okay, never mind. It's nothing important. Maybe it is important. Maybe they got kidnapped. I don't know. I don't really follow some of the stuff that happens here. Okay, Dokali. So let's go and grab ourselves a... Oh, wait. Hold on. No, I doubt that would activate anything. But you never know. We're going to go to the agency building just real fast to see if anything's in there for us. But I really do feel like that building, the race car building, has something hidden inside of it that we have yet to find. Because some stuff may take long. Because I feel like Wolfpack's getting way better at hiding secrets. So we might not be able to find it super duper fast. It may take some time to get it. But here we are inside here. Let's activate all of these just like that. It looks like somebody already went in here and activated a few things. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm talking about right now. Oh, look at that. Nighttime's approaching. We're not even in the helicopter yet. Rod in Robbies with the T's that look upside down, which is pretty crazy, I get to say. But yeah, helicopter. Helicopter, we need you. We need ya. And by the way, did you realize that the um, race car house also has antennae on it? Pretty awesome. Pretty weird. It probably doesn't mean anything. But let's go and do this. Go up here like that. And now we activate it like this. There we go. Okay. So now we need to find where my... Okay. It, okay. That's... There it is. I was going to say it. They both had antennae on them. Okay. So let's go ahead over there right now and... See what's under the map. We may have to wait to daytime hit. So if there's a cut, you know why there's a cut. Because honestly, sometimes it's really hard to see stuff at night. And we really don't want to have to deal with that. So let's go ahead down there right now and see what's down there. Okay, now we're under the map. And right next to us is the military base. But we already explored that. So we're going to try to see what we can see inside here without causing too much trouble. Okay, we need to finagle ourselves just right. And we need to back up. Just so we're, we're clipping it just enough. And now let's go forward, up, and... No, that's not working. Oh, oh, back, back. Let's try to get ourselves to clip it just... Okay, there we go. Awesome. 
So as you see, there is nothing under this map at all. Like this right here is all that's under here. There may be like something like, no, there's nothing right there, but there is like a little ramp that goes on right there. But there is a lot of room under here, honestly, guys. Like, oh, there goes the, like the camera angle thing going on right now. But yeah, it doesn't look like anything is under here. But that doesn't stop us from going on top of the, the, the race house. I couldn't actually think of the name right real quick. Maybe we'll find something on top of it. Maybe not. I don't know. We needed some speed. Speed is sometimes key. Here we come into the the, the house. I keep wanting to say military base because it's right next door, but it's not the what I'm looking for. Okay, we need to get a little bit more forward. There we go. There we go. And now we drop down. I love how the water looks so realistic in Brookhaven, though. It looks so cool. So we have these two antenna, which... Whoa, I didn't realize this, but they're off? Wait, what? Why are they off? Like, they should be on. Like, over here, those ones are on. But these ones are 100% off. And that's really weird. I don't know why, but they are. But yeah, this is what the ceiling looks like all together. It doesn't look like there's anything up here. But we could go up here, look around, and we can see all the rooms. We can see this room. We can see that room. And this one right here, by the way, is a tad bit more thick than it probably should be. Which probably means nothing because there was nothing down there, but there may be something in there. So now that's a reason to check it. Look at the back area. It just has like, wait, hold up. Do you guys realize that this act back here has like the whole, I like, I don't know what you want to call them. They're just, it just looks interesting, okay? It looks really cool. Okay, so now let's go. Okay, where's the front? I don't even know where my own front door is. I am so dumb sometimes. There we go. So let's go back up into that room real quick to see if there's anything up there okay so here we are we have the bed ready we're gonna go right no not right there let's go right here there we go can we go inside there we go and let's turn ourselves just enough and wow it actually won't let me oh gosh i fell outside of it that's not what i was trying to do i honestly was not trying to sneak out of my own bed no i was trying to actually see what's inside of it but no it didn't want to let me see it just didn't want to let me be okay i guess we had to go with the sideways because that's the only way it's going to work. Uh, or not? Ah, there we go. This is what I wanted. Yes. Okay. So, it looks like there's nothing up here either. I feel like, I, in my gut feeling, there is definitely something else here. But we have yet to find it. Maybe it's going to be in a future update. Or maybe it's already here. Or maybe I'm just going crazy. But for now, guys, we're going to end it there. But now you know hiding places galore. You know the secret safe location. And... You know, this place is just great for hide and seek. Till next time, guys. Thank you all for watching and bye. Bye.